Hello, my name is Luke Allen. I'm EveryFile's MD, and I'm here today to talk about EveryFile in AAC production control rooms. So now we're going to dive into EveryFile in the control room environment to look at how we would set up a typical project within a control room. On the left hand side, we can see our project and all of our jobs plotted onto a map. On the middle screen, we can see each individual job and the workflow associated with it. So each job and the steps it needs to go through before that job is completed. On the right hand screen, we've got the job itself with all the configured data that we have uh, that we set up for this job and a connection to that job and the tasks for the job within the BIM model powered by 3D Repo. So the real power of using every file within a control room is we get to see all of our data on one screen. So we can literally click on the map, view the job itself, view all the details around the job and have a status that we can see in real time for every single activity within our specific project. If we then want to start to manage the tasks and jobs, we can select the job and we can start to work with that job from the control room. So no more WhatsApp for photos, no more emails. It's all centralized in the control room so we can see everything that's happening at all times. If I want to select this job and send it out to somebody in the field, I can move that to a new state and once that job has been moved, it will update the tablets um, and we can also allocate these jobs out to mean that we can manage the inspection and who deals with that job um, between the control room and each device. So the real power of every file in the AAC production control room is the real-time nature of the data we've collected on the tablet and the ability to report that in Power BI. So here we have a demonstration dashboard showing how we can use that data to deliver real-time insights to those in the control room collected from the field and linked to all the other data that we have available. So here we have all of the uh, quality checks that have been completed that have failed. Um, we can see that data in real time. We can start to analyze that from a cost perspective in terms of where things have gone wrong and, and what they've cost the project, uh, and as well as where things have gone well. We can break that down by contractor. And if we want to get into the detail, we can drill through into the detail and get a separate drill down dashboard into the tasks uh, where the responsibility of the error lies and where we are against our original schedule. Another really powerful use case for the control room is where we look at bringing in BIM data, field data, risks, issues and health and safety into a single dashboard. This example was built out with, the, with MACE across the Innovate UK project which includes Mission Room, EviFile and 3D Repo delivering the hardware and software. So here we can see how many risks are currently active and we can use this the control room to actually navigate and drill down into the model using 3d repos power bi model viewer we can then start to assess within each room or floor or zone within the building what are the risks uh, how many uh, risks do we have by status what are the likelihood of those risks to cause us an issue and we can start to drill down even further into risks by contractor and also where the risk relationships actually tie together. So using the three uh, software platforms in terms of 3D repo and every file for the data and mission room software to bring it all together in the control room environment has enabled us to bring many different data sets together within a control room setting to enable us to make better decisions and deliver better project insights through the control room.